Hi folks, it's Foodie Friday. Yes, I'm back. And that is a Lewis slice. It's an extremely cheesy. So it'll be interesting to see what that is actually like when we cut them open. Now you did see the frozen pie going round. It's just the frozen pie. You know what I'm saying? Now I will tell you, this bakes for 30 minutes at an oven temperature of 200 Celsius. Hey, not rocket science but I'm going to be really interested to see what that is like inside. So let's have a look at all the nutrients and all the rubbish that goes inside. So that's all the nutrients. And that's all the ingredients. Now this particular pie is available from their website. And also, if you've got a bakery business, they come in a box of 30. Hey, and they deliver to your door as well, apparently, if you're down in Wales. Bakers, we can get them delivered anywhere in the UK. But in Wales, you can actually get doorstep delivery from Lewis's. They are the largest manufacturer of pies, pasties, and sausage rolls, beef sausage rolls, in the whole of Wales. And if I never mentioned it, they're in a little place called Swansea. So we now know that that is extremely cheesy. So let's go for the test and see what it's like. First and full, fat test. Uh, it's about usual, you know, we know what their pastry is like because this is a standard Lewis's pasty pie or whatever you want to call it, pastry. So let's whack it open and have a look. Oh, I'm looking for the, I love cheesy stuff. Oh, and it's well filled. That's even better. Yes. Look at that, folks. You can actually see the cheese in it. I bet that's not Welsh cheese. That looks like Leicestershire cheese. Smells good. I'm not gonna bother with, I'm not, I'm not gonna go for the, the pastry test because it is Lewis's pastry. But actually on the top, they've got some like bread crummy stuff on the top. So it's been dipped in some up. And that gives that like, like a bit of crunch. Let's, let's get straight down to it. Mm, my favorite, cheesy. Cool, and that is exactly what it says. Cheesy. Mm. Mm, cool, that is lovely, that is. That filling is right up there. It's got a nice creaminess. It's got just the right amount of salt in. Pepper's on the money. A little bit of tingle in there. Nothing to upset me. <laughs> You'll know if it is. But what I like is the combination with that pastry, with this stuff they put on the top, just makes it, I reckon. And inside, though, as it says, extremely cheesy. You can taste a bit of mustard. You've got your onion in there. So you could call it a cheese and onion pasty, couldn't you? Or a slice or whatever you want to call it. But that is really, really nice. I'm liking that a lot. And dare I say this, I do sell this in my shop. I've never had one before. And people keep coming backwards for these. Obviously we do about, I think, there's about six or seven different variations of cheese, cheese and onion pies, actually in pasties and different things in our shop. That's what we base ourselves on is, we tend to do a lot of everything and give customers a really good choice and for me, you Welsh boys, you're on the money. That is a solid nine out of 10. You know, keep pulling things like that out and I can tell you, you're spot on. Okay, your pastry's always a bit ropey, but you know, that combination, sometimes it don't matter about the pastry. If the, the inside and the pastry works, you're on the money. And if you like this type of content, Please subscribe and please share. And don't forget to check out the playlist because I've got a lot of different things down there. Plenty of product reviews. And also, don't forget, this is a baking channel and there's a lot of baking videos down there for you guys. And you can also see me dossing around the bakery in some of those videos. And we'll see you again very shortly on the Crazy Baker channel. Laters! This is the Crazy Baker channel. Baking lifestyle
recipes, reviews, I am the crazy baker. Please subscribe and please share. Laters!